Hey guys, and welcome back to another video of our Let's Play on Skyrim. Now, today what we're going to be doing is we are going to be starting a new quest line. And the plan for it is to try and do the Civil War quests. In the last video, what we did is we came, well, we did pretty much a load of random stuff. We went all around the map trying to find things. Um, we also adopted a child. And we also killed a dragon. We came out here to summon, what was his name, Dover here or something like that. Uh, we learned the first word of soul tearing. And then we had to fight a legendary dragon. So that was pretty, um, that was a pretty exciting thing to the end of it. What's that? Oh, it's a moose. For some reason I thought that was a dragon ring. Um, yeah. Since then the dragon's despawned, I'm not sure where it's gone. It was here, but I don't know where it is now. But I have some news to tell you. Um, after I, well, just before I loaded up today's game, I went to load it up, and the last save, well, the latest save point was that just before I went to Riften. And I didn't understand that. So I teleported to Riften, well, teleported to that thing, um, and it loaded the game at Riften, where I just arrived. I went in, and apparently I hadn't adopted a child yet, and I hadn't killed the dragon yet. So I was very confused about that. I went in, um, talked about it again, and I was like, okay, well, I'll just do it again then. So I did it again, and then the child that I adopted in the last video, I think it was called, I think her name's Runa, the little girl. I adopted her, and she wasn't there this time. She was just completely gone. It's like, wasn't even there at the orphanage. So I asked about it, like, looked around, see if there's any glitches, didn't say anything. So I looked it up again, sort of the same thing. So I adopted another child, and that's basically what I'm trying to say here. We had to adopt another child, because I have not a clue what happened to the save. It just didn't save, I think, and that's why we're here again. I, I killed the dragon, I learned the shout again, and I adopted a child, but we got a different child. That's pretty much the only thing that's changed. Also, out of episode, I um I sold a load of stuff, so if you look now, actually, there we go. If you can see that I've got hardly anything on me, anyone I've got hardly any carry weight stuff. But yeah, enough talking, let's get straight to it. Um, Civil War quests are somewhere, but I'm just gonna go to my house first and check with my new son. Um, that is settling okay. There we go, Lakeview Manor. Okay, let's see where everyone is. It's night time. Night time. Would he be inside? I don't know if he'll be inside or outside. And why is it when you spawn at your house, all the chickens and all the animals like come outside first? I also need to talk to that guy about getting another house, uh, another cow as well. Because unfortunately that died in the last episode because I think, yeah, bandits raided the place. So anyway. Hopefully my son's settling okay. I think his name's Raw, something like that. What? Hello, Sven. Or Kovu, as I like to call him. Oh, there he is. A real home, a real family. I almost can't believe it. This is more than I ever could have hoped for. Thanks. Thanks so much. That's fine. So yeah, we were gonna. Ha I was gonna get um, the girl called Runa, but unfortunately she just didn't like. She just wasn't there at all. So we've now got Blaze and we've got Raw. I don't know if you say it um, with a H or not. I think you just say Raw. So, yeah, we got Blaze and Raw. They're going to bed now. What time is it? Yes, yeah, 11 p.m. It's about the time I know goes to bed. Oh well. Hey, Pa. Hello. I think that's all I really came here for. I just wanted to see um, if I needed to talk to him or not, but apparently I don't. You look like a traveler. Um, so, yeah, we're now going to do the Civil War quests. Um, I don't remember how they start out. Come hear me play at the sleeping I think what we have in. to do is we have to activate one of the miscellaneous quests, and then it tells us to go to somewhere. Then the second word. Bring. Okay, I don't understand what that is. Um, oh yeah, we need to do it again, don't we? We need to get the second word, then the third, obviously. Uh, join the Imperial Legion. There we go. Some even need to pick this off. Where do we need to go? This way. I think it's Solitude we need to go. We need to talk to that um, woman, don't we? I think her name is Legia Rika or something like that. One of the two. Okay, cool. It's daytime for once in this place. Let's go around. Are they in the uh, Castle Dower place? I think they are. There's a load of quests that we haven't even activated yet that I do want to do. Like, there's one for that. You hear the news? What? The Emperor has been murdered, right here in Skyrim. By the gods, if the Dark Brotherhood can do that, nobody's safe. I did not do that. Not me, definitely not me. Yeah, there's a quest that you can do around these places. There's one for this guy down here, you can't see him anymore. But there's an Argonian down there. There was quests that I remember doing for By someone the gods, the Emperor has been for someone at the uh, docks, I think. The Windhelm docks. And there's also um, a load of quests you can do around there for a load of Argonian workers as well. Um, I do actually, I like the Argonians in this game, like, in general, because I'm an Argonian myself. I'm the only one they like, because everyone else doesn't like them, so I'm the only one they like, and it's awesome. Uh, you. Hello. You survived Helgen? General Tullius told me what happened. Not many made it out alive. I've got a good feeling about you, and I don't often get good feelings about anything. A warrior knows to trust her gut. I'm not going to go through the normal process with you. I've got a little test lined up. Pass that, and we'll talk about you joining the Legion. All right, I can end anything you throw at me. Is that confidence or bravado? Confidence I can use. Bravado gets soldiers killed. We'll soon find out. 
I'm sending you to clear out Fort Haragstad. If you survive, you'll pass. If you die, then I'll have no further use for your corpse. No one will need um, any use my corpse, really. The ancients built many of the fortresses that dot the landscape of Skyrim. Sadly, most have fallen into disrepair, and nearly all have been overrun with bandits or other vagabonds. Fort Haragstad is one of the few that remains mostly intact. We're going to install a garrison there, but first, you're going to clean out the bandits that have moved in. All right. Um, I'm going alone. Consider that fort already yours. Good, that's what I want to hear. Now go make it happen, soldier. All right. We got a new quest now, or is that just what it is? I think joining the Legion, I'm yeah. I swear there's a quest oh. called something like the Jagged Crown or something. That's the only quest I remember doing. Cousin Kiri. Then I also remember right so there's a quest where you got to, like, take over Whiterun or defend it or something. Depending on which side you're on, you either defend it or take it over. Where's the thing? Right there's the map. Closest thing I've got is whatever this place is here. Okay. What's that over there? Oh, it looked like a quest marker because there's a cave inside that thing. Um, this way then. I don't know why it wasn't marked on the map. It had like the. It told me where the quest marker was, but it didn't like outline the fortress on the map. That was pretty weird. Oh, well, that's Kajara still with me? Yeah, Kajara's with me. I just didn't hear him like following behind me, so I didn't know if he was still there or not. What's oh, a standing stone? Should we go see what the standing stone is? This is what I like about Skyrim. You just wander around and you find anything. Um, this cave seems to be closing in a bit. I want the I want the standing stone though. I wouldn't know what it is. Um, I think I've still got my standing stone from the very start. You know the um, what did I pick? I think it was a thief stone. It's so long ago now. Literally 102 episodes ago now. So that's more than two days worth of hours ago. I think I've played this game for something like nearly five days worth of hours. It's ridiculous. I'm not actually sure though. He does say I'm on the leaderboard thing. Um, I'm actually, I'm very proud of that because I'm rank one out of most of my friends. Well, all of my friends actually. I think I'm just the maniac who plays Skyrim way too much. And not many other people play it, so that's fine by me. Um, what standing stones are this then? Is this an interesting one or is it going to be a boring one? The speed, uh, seed stone. Um, Sunder may carry more and do not suffer from movement. Or pen What does that mean? Oh, suffer from movement at penalty. Oh, okay. That's a pretty good one, but I don't need it, to be honest. Um, yeah, I don't really need that, because I've got um, the armor thing anyway that allows me to not, like... The arm my armor at the moment doesn't weigh anything. I've already got that perk, mate. So, thank you, but no thank you. I don't need that. And I can see the fort in the distance. We should be arriving there in about one minute. Probably less than that, actually. Closer than I thought. Everything in this game, you think, is miles away, but then when you actually go for it, it normally is pretty close. Oh, hello. The ancient dragon's just loaded back in. Why does this game do that? It scares the life out of me. And why does it spawn inside me? So obviously that was the ancient dragon from um, Riften then. Because <laughs> I haven't killed any other ones. Oh, I can hear another dragon though. I can hear something. I heard like a screech in the sky. Oh well. There's a boat over there as well. Sunken boat. Where is that? Oh, it's down there. Yeah, it's sunken boat. Run aground. Run aground in the storm. Go in. Oh, yeah, it is a surprise. Wait, can I kill this guy with my fist? Let me just try doing this. Yes! Pretty much. Bandits are useless in this game. They don't do anything. I see that like, I can one-shot with my fist. This one's like 10 hits. If that. Come on. I'm gonna... I'm beating this guy. And he's using an like, iron battle axe. I'm just way too overpowered for me. And I thought the Khajiit were overpowered when they had the, um... When they had the claws on their hands. Hello, sir, up there. Would you like to die by fist? Come on. Die! Oh, I can't even jump. There we go. What's this thing? Restoration, I think. Oh yeah, I think I used this when Kajara nearly died out of episode. Come on. Gonna rip you open. It's fine, I'm gonna kill you first. I'm just gonna see if I can go through this thing and just punch another one. It was so useless. Why is, is that oh no it's not. I thought Kajara was marking it as an enemy then. What have I gotta do? Um I draw an Legion. Clear out the fort. In order to prove myself, I need to clear I oh, just clear out the bandits, okay. Is this another chest or is that the one I just went to? It's empty. You look from a different angle. So I'm assuming I have to kill these guys appeared then. I will kill them all by punching them in the face. Because that's how it works in this game. It's probably this dragon armor to be honest. It's probably what it's doing it. Just throw a load of dragon bones at them, it hurts them. Hello! How you doing? Oh, this guy's a bit strong. Come on! You're not gonna beat me. 
I like how bandits do less damage to me than uh, undead people do. It's ridiculous. Come on. Just die. There we go. I'm assuming we have to go inside. It isn't just going to be outside. Is it? Oh well. Straight in we go. I probably will change the sword because whereas it is fun, it's just a bit annoying. No, you know what I might do? I might do magic actually. Let's go for magic. I very rarely use magic in this game. Um, firebolt. There we go. What's the other one? I swear I have another one as well. Oh, it's ice spikes. Oh, look. Look, this does less damage than my fist. Come on. There we go. We got ourselves a hero. Yes, we do. Come on. Oh, Jerry, you got him away. Oh, he got him. Oh, this is the chief. Come on, Kajaro, whack him once. I gave him that stronger sword. It's got the sword of frost, by the way. So that's why he's sending blue. Kajaro's gonna freeze you and I'm gonna heat you up. There we go. So I'm also gonna get my in destruction increased by doing this. That's pretty cool. I'm a thirst and just gonna take the gold, thanks. I'm assuming we have to keep going because um, normally it's the chief that you have to take out, but I guess there's gonna be someone else down there. And once again, there's no quest markers. That ain't gonna help me. Minor healing, I'm not bothered about all that. It just wastes all my carry space, really. I said this in the previous video, but I need to stop picking up so many small healing potions. Because they don't do enough to warrant them being that heavy. So, there's literally no point doing it. Saying that, as I think I just picked up another one there, so... Oh well, I'm a hypocrite. Where are the bandits, then? I'm going to heat this meat up. There we go. I heated the meat up. There's a lot of stuff to steal around here. A lot of gold. There we go. Extreme, vigorous, and ultimate. Those are the main potions I want to focus on right now. There's a map. What have we got? Map of Skyrim. I've got that map. It's behind me right now. Uh, the Golden River Merit. Actually increased. Nice. There's melon there. There's a gauntlet. There's more armor. I'd have to go now then. Wandering round still, I guess. I guess there's a way down, isn't there? Not a way down. Not where to go. Where do I have to go? Is that it? Is that really it? There's no one else in there. Now what? So... Oh, wrong thing. Clear out fort. I've done that. Unless there's something in there. Well, let me get my, uh, my other magic spell on. I hate... Why is the game not giving me any quest markers so far? Here we go. I've got to go. No path seen. Oh, that's useful. So... I know we have to just kill everyone in here, but like, where are they? I've got no mark enemies on my map, so that's not helping me. Um, I've got no quest markers to tell me a certain person that I need to kill. It's just a load of random stuff. A glass bow. I'm not going to take that. Oh, is that Dave Carrows? Oh, it is. Nice. I thought they were, um, I thought they were ebony arrows for a minute, and I realised they're Daedric ones. Is there no one here? There's got to be someone. I'm going to go back inside. There's going to be a whole other place that's going to open up, isn't it? Then again, there might be a different doorway, actually, now that I think about it. Let's have a look. There's that doorway there that we just went in. I feel like that's what the doorway would be, though. <coughs> seeing as there's nowhere else that looks like anywhere of interest. Oh, wait, that's the door, isn't it? Ah, oh, that's where we just went, so let's go in this one, then. There we go, prison. Hopefully we might find something in here. <laughs> I don't know if we're trying to find something, or just literally clearing it out. Ah, oh, there we go. Hello, I've only got one thing. Oh, he's killed him. Get rid of that. I have uh, a fist. I don't want that. Come on. Um, destruction again. No, I don't want flames. I want the other one. There we go. Thank you. Oh, there we go. Now we've got a quest mark. Why didn't he give me that quest marker before? What's he doing? What's he doing down here? Hello. This guy's going to die. Come on. Get my destru destruction up and armor. There we go. Problem solved. Now what? Is that it? Can I leave now? Diamond and that. Diamonds are pretty cool in this game, even though they don't do anything. Brief history battle? Nothing for that. I want skill books. I've got a lot of food down here. Lots of prison cells. Nothing else of interest in there. I thought there'd be chests in them or something. Oh well, is that it then? Let's go. That was pretty easy. I thought that was gonna be, thought was gonna be more difficult than what it was. Then again, I think the Imperial Legion is probably one of the easiest quests because, well, just the Imperial Legion in general. Because I think it just wants you to. Um, oh, there's someone up here. 
Because it wants you to like, this is like the first, one of the first quests of the game. So I, oh. so I think it's not supposed to be difficult. There we go. Like, the Imperial quests and the Stormclaw quests are supposed to be the start of the game, so they're not supposed to be that difficult, I don't think. Okay. Night time again. I love the way this day works. Either daytime or night time, and you're never anywhere in between. So anyway, I did it. Yay. What's the uh, hurry? Uh, I'm trying to report back to the person. Gears making through. The road to White Run's not safe these days. Lots of I don't care. Just I don't care about Dragon Bridge or whatever you were talking about. It's boring and it's pointless. And I think I've been there actually. I think I've been I've been to Dragon Bridge. It's that little town that's like Tell miles me again why I'm wasting what? my eyes open after a fairy tale. dragons could swoop down at any If Ulfric gets his hand on that crown, it won't be a fairy tale. It'll be a problem. Told you about the crown. Don't you know it? Welcome back, soldier. I'm glad you made it in one piece. I'll send men to garrison king. the fort right away. You did well. I'm impressed. But before we go any further, it's time for you to officially join the Legion. Speak with General Tullius. He'll administer the oath. Okay. In joining the Legion, you'll be taking an oath binding you to the service of the Emperor, and thus to every citizen of the Empire. Are you prepared to make that commitment? Yep. Um, I'm ready. Well then, repeat after me. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor. Even though I killed him. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. Once again, I still killed him. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail in my duty. Okay. Why not? Long live the Emperor. Long live the Empire. Welcome to the Imperial Legion, soldier. Just remember, we take care of our own. Once you're in the Legion, you're in it for life. Speak to Baron. He's normally out by the forge. He'll get you outfitted. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. Does she? I was just about the crown thing. Um, failed during the tour. <laughs> I wonder why. That, I wonder why that said failed. Then I got scared. Um, if got to go? Ulfric gets his hand on that crown. I'm talking to you. Shut up. Welcome to the Legion Auxiliary. Listen up. I thought the moot chose the king. We're backing Elisif. When the moot meets, they'll do the sensible thing. Not everyone's agreed to the moot. You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't always sensible. We follow our hearts. So what? Ulfric gets this crown and then suddenly he's High King? No, it's not as simple as that. But the jagged crown would be a potent symbol for his cause to rally around. Why has Kajawa got a sniff like that? if we found it first... And we gave it to Elisif. In the absence of the moot, it would further legitimize her claim. Perhaps. I'm entrusting you with what resources I can spare. But I'm warning you. If this turns out to be a waste of time and men, it won't be a waste. Make sure you take the auxiliary here. You can send him back when you get there and find nothing but old bones and cobwebs. The Stone Fist's no fool. He's found the crown, but we'll get to it first. So I'm guessing we have to find the crown then, because that's what we did last time. Welcome to the Legion, auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right hand man. Galmar Stonefist has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjun. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. Alright then. Uh, what's the Jagged Crown? What's the mission? How do we know the crown is there? I don't care about any of that. Don't wait for me. Get to Corvinjun as soon as you're ready. I'll meet you there. Okay, well I'm not ready yet. I'm just gonna go talk to that guy about getting my armor first. If you must venture southwest, stay clear of Volskike. Oh. This is a cursed place. A tomb where the dead still live. I've already been there. I've already got the mask, mate. Why does it get the same map updated? I've already got the mask. I'm gonna wait till. Should I wait till daytime? Yeah, I might as well. Then again, I think by the time I've waited till daytime, it's probably gonna be the end of the video, but oh well. I wanna get the armor off this guy first, or whatever he's gonna give me. I think they all give you rubbish stuff, though, because I've already got a Daedric sword, but it's pretty much the best weapon in the game. So there's no point about it. I think the, I think actually the, um, what do you call it now, the, what's the other thing called? 
the dragon sword. The dragon bone sword is probably slightly tight. I think it's like two points better, but it's uglier, so I don't want it. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. Um, can, can I, I tell you, you get me outfitted? Yep. I just have one question for you. Light, medium, or heavy? Um, heavy. They don't make finer steel anywhere else. If this doesn't keep you from dying, nothing will. Now that's it. One free outfit per soldier. You lose that, or get it banged up. You'll need to pay like everyone else. Okay. Thank you. Return anytime you need. So what's he actually giving me then? I bet it's all rubbish, but I'm just going to quickly check it. So, I've also got this East Empire pendant we need to um, sort out. We need to give that to that random guy. Imperial armor. Imperial... Yeah, it's all just that random stuff. I'm going to sell it back to some, per some person because I don't want it. But yeah. Um, that's probably going to be it for this episode, guys. We did quite a lot then. We started the main quest. Um, next episode, we're going to go hopefully find the Jagged Crown and stop Ulfric Stormcloak before we can get it. But as for now, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.